it brings me no pleasure to say this, but Piers Morgan was right about a thing once. Days after Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's fairy tale wedding, Piers Morgan ominously predicted that season two of Royal Life would be harder than season one. If you thought being a royal girlfriend was difficult, just wait until you see how hard it is being a royal wife. Piers penned in his special timeout corner at the Daily Mail, where he writes his acidic screeds, frothing at the mouth, raving mad, safely away from others. Now, of course, he never reflected on how he participated in making her life unbearable. The allure of profit-driven outrage punditry more tantalizing than a clean conscience. Journalistic ethics dropped as quickly as that damn spirit stick in Bring It On. That's just a snippet of my latest piece on my Substack. I'm doing a series about racism and reporting from the British media on individuals in the British royal family or marginalized individuals who have dated royals. This is part 2.5. I have a link to the first part, which focuses on Meghan and Harry's coverage before they got married. This looks into post-wedding coverage. Y'all, we have graphs. We have quotes from Charles Mill, Afua Hirsch. I mean, this is everything. If you want to read more, you can click the link on my bio and click on Substack or meredithconstant.substack.com. It's free to subscribe. Since I'm kind of sort of probably writing a book, I thought, not a bad time to practice show you guys what's on my mind. Maybe little inklings of what could turn into paragraphs in my book. Who knows?